I am Pakistani and you are Mr. Pakistan at all. Where is me? I will teach you how you can use. Ah. Real state. What is a real state? It looks like that. Quite a bit bulky. Real state. It is used in chemists, uh, physics. What is this thing? Is? This is a real state which is what is uh, a register, very, very register, just like the planchometer. You can see my first slide there are various of planchometers. It's not tail. But they are too so small. But this is a bigger size. A uh, very very resistor. But these resistors are very tiny resistors right, right now. A uh, potential meter is very common common thing. Which is very cheap, like 20 to 30 rupees. Or uh, more than very cheap and small size. Carry with pocket. And also available in high resistance. Like kilo ohms, thousand. One kilo ohm, two kilo ohm, two, uh, two mega ohm. Or the other ohms. But this resistor is maximum is 200 ohms. And these tiny resistors. Now the resistors are not working with more than a few milliamps, but it will work life in, in two amps. So first, you can use series and parallel. First, in series. Now, one wire right there, and this line now has a 12 volt. And one wire, I put the voltage in nature positive. And one wire negative, I one of the terminal of the view of that. And other terminal views of an LED data clip. So a, this is a wiper, real state wiper, which is also known as a transmitter, which I think that's there. Transmitter knob, you can say it is the same word like the transmitter knob. Now it's not there. It is the meter, and then we can add here in the red, this tussle. I need to slip in. Also. And you can see it's showing 11 volts, but here we can do 13 volts. When I move this wiper, this wiper, wiper, it's a little bit hard to move. So you can see voltage are decreasing. I mean 8.4. And when I move the wiper this way, it slowly ramps. But this way, it is not voltage, but it, this way it's limited the current. Now I change a little bit, remove the voltmeter. This time, see, in case of series, it will increase or decrease the resistance. So we cannot change the voltage, so that's why I put this here in the LED. Right now, LED is brighter. And well, I. And you can see, LED is slower and LED is brighter. Even. Slower and brighter. It is not too much. The, Depend because this time this real state is only 200 ohms, so that's why it will not work too. Uh, and but it will dim the LED brightness and increase the brightness. Well, push this way in series, this way you can make a variable resistance or variable load. For example, you need some efficient marine or some force like the solar panel or battery. You can put this in, in parallel with battery and carefully trim them. Because if it and it even mind when you can have a battery, battery is lower than one, two amps battery will be what? If you do not more than two amps battery, it will fry your your skin. You can diminish your LED brightness also you can add like a variable load in series configuration. Also that's a parallel configuration. This which the transmission is at the voltage wider. Now I remove this and turn the transfer in the end position. And let the positive to there. And it will act like the two resistors in series. Like under ohm, under ohm, or something like that. And this time I use a meter. Meter wires. One will be down into the supply wire because you know. And the resistor will. Resistor or variable, a voltage divider is always negative, is always common between your resistor and power supply and your load. In this case, it's working. Now it's like that there. This way it works little bit reverse, but all reverse means wiper is under position. And well, I 
this one will not work. And it's been deep selling over full. And then I think probably by sliding this wiper or tussle and you can see voltage will be dropped. But this means the minimum limit is 4.5 volts. So otherwise it will turn off line out 4.5 volts. And with a still full position it will clearly slowly pushing up and it will make a slow voltage up. You can adjust input the filter in volt and whatever voltage you want to in less than 15 volts and in constant and you can adjust the output voltage by moving the salt just like a variable resistor and you can turn on your load without any transistor and anything your load ampere is about them at less than 2 amps now I trim it back it's increase the, vol increase the voltage until it will shut down and if this there I remove these meters and right now at my same way LED LEDs should also be dim and bright just like that previously and it will end up to 2 amps which means 20 watts of load light full just light iron so you may know you can see the iron top point when you put the lever the left side it will slower the right side it will faster same way it works and same way the transmitter is also works the transmitter is oval shape oval shape and very tiny at large amount of ohm resistance in case of this but that transmitter or very resistor cannot take more than few milliamp load but it will take more load like 2 amp and I will show you what it is a potentiometer and these are potentiometer this potentiometer is a same thing just like this your stack and this potentiometer is their first light or your fan regulator but their difference is this this is so small and compared to portable and it is very cheap and more resistance like 50 day 50,000 ohms 10,000 ohms or 100,000 ohms and 5,000 ohms and etc. But this one is only 200 ohms and size also very also expensive. But why use this instead use this? But this one cannot turn your load directly on because it will not too powerful if you are going to see that parallel. You don't attach it parallel this thing with some resistor like a voltage wider but you cannot let with series it. It was serious test your load drawing power with this potentiometer and it overloads and it burns. And this video is going to be the next video.